What's up, everyone? Welcome to my channel. I'm Timothy Allen Milam Jr., and you're watching Milam Asylum. Thanks for tuning into this review. Uh, please like and share, and maybe I can earn your subscription, but if not, totally cool. And yes, obviously, it's whoosh, Tim's Cascade Style Sasquatch Surprise Potato Chips. Extra thick and crunchy, gluten free. That is correct. Now, this caught me by surprise, and I'm a little bit curious about how they're going to taste. Hopefully they're not just a generic regular potato chip where we're getting nothing. Um, I mean, I like a good potato chip, but you know, Sasquatch surprise. At least make them semi-interesting, not just bore us with these, uh, um, you know, uh, just a regular potato chip. Nobody wants that. Uh, I mean, I don't, but uh, maybe some people out there do. And you know, which I'm all for. That's cool. But uh, let's get into it and see how uh, they taste and all the flavor and everything. All right. Oh, they look kind of, uh, they look orange and like a barbecue flavors on them. They don't smell like a barbecue. I really don't. They, eh, maybe a little bit. I'm, I don't know. There's a, it, it's a, it's got a very unique scent that I can't even come close to even telling you what it is. I can, I guess I can kind of semi smell some kind of a barbecue, but maybe I'm just tricking my mind into believing that I smell fucking barbecue. Um, let's taste one and see what it tastes like. All right. Here you guys go, if you can look at it. It's uh, very orange in color, like a barbecue. Now, before I taste this, let's just get... If it's a barbecue flavored potato chip with Sasquatch, you kind of just failed and dropped the ball. Come on, Tim. Because um, with Sasquatch and Surprise, I don't know. I don't, you know, I don't know what kind of... But I wouldn't have had just a barbecue flavored potato chip. It just, just seems kind of fucking stupid, really, if you think about it. As far as a Sasquatch goes, I'm not saying, you know, make Sasquatch flavored potato chips that taste like shit or something, but, or tree bark, or whatever the fuck a Sasquatch eats. Um, but, you know, at least make it a, a unique flavor. So, let's make sure this isn't just a barbecue flavored potato chip. Okay, it's a barbecue potato chip, but there's definitely honey mustard on it. Definitely. I taste mustard. Let's see if they have a flavor thing in here. Uh, nope, they do not tell you whatsoever about anything. It's just your typical ingredients for potato chips. So this is made in the great Pacific Northwest, Oregon. Um, well, this is out of Washington, so. But, uh, but most, the, this slogan is basically like Oregon. Um, Tim started cooking potato chips in the shadow of the Cascade Mountains in 1986. Three years after I was born, because my name's Tim, and I inspired him to make this. That's a fun fact for you guys. But I'm, I'm just jokes, jokes. Anyways, um, with your first satisfying, no, literally, follow by the kettle-style flavor of premium potatoes, perfectly seasoned, we think you'll agree that you have found what you have been looking for. We're dedicated to making thick chips that are as close to perfect as the Pacific Northwest itself. Make it loud, make it bold, make it local, make it Tim's. So, I, these are actually very good. And yes, they are a barbecue flavored potato chip with
I'm going to say honey mustard. I'm going to say honey mustard. And slight, I can actually now taste a slight vinegar flavor as well. Maybe the surprise is that it just transforms different flavors. I don't know. I'll do one more. This is breaking my meat diet. But I don't think three little potato chips are going to hurt me. So it's definitely like a like a honey mustard, a salt and vinegar, and a barbecued chip. So they did definitely made it unique. They definitely gave it an, an, an alternative flavor um, and didn't just cop out with a barbecue flavor potato chip. So whoosh, good job, you guys. These are actually really fucking good. Um, but we're going to compare potato chips, the Tim's um, jalapenos, is that what they're called? Uh, I believe that's what they're called. Tim's, it's Tim's jalapeno think um but if we're going to compare those to these those are 10 times better but uh as far as the this flavor goes this was actually uh two for six dollars at a fred meyers so get them while they're hot um but these are a 7.9 out of 10 that's your review i'm timothy allen Lyman jr and until next time fuck off